In Luke chapter 5, verse 4, it reads, When he had finished speaking, he said to Simon, Put out into the deep water and let down the nets for a catch. You see, Jesus gives a command to Simon after ministering to the crowd, saying, Let's get into the deep. Let's catch fish. If you look at the background of what had happened, we see Simon saying that they, they had gone out all night and they were tired and they caught nothing. They had caught nothing. But do you know that when God speaks a word, things begin to change. When God speaks, miracles happen. What happened next is they begin to catch, not just catch fish, they catch fish overflowing. So much so that they had to ask others to help them out. When God speaks, things happen. When we look into Peter, when he saw Jesus walking on water, Peter speaks to Jesus and says, If it is you, command me to come. And Jesus says, Come. When God speaks, miracles happen. And Peter began to walk over waters. We see when Lazarus was in the tomb, he was days in the tomb. His body was, I'm sure, smelling by then. But Jesus spoke out and said, Lazarus, come out. When God speaks, miracles happen. And Lazarus came out from that tomb alive. When God speaks, things begin to happen. I want to encourage you. Meditate on his word. Read his word. Suddenly, the word that you are reading will become alive. A rema word that will begin to work miracles in your life. Don't neglect studying and reading the word because that's where you will begin to see God ministering to you. Hallelujah. So I want to tell you when God speaks, miracles happen. No matter how bad that situation is, maybe you're going through lack, maybe you're going through a time where there's, there's a storm around you, or maybe you feel that your flesh is failing, or maybe you feel that, that sickness and death is surrounding you. But I want to tell you, no matter what your, pro, your present is, when God speaks, miracles 